I'm Dr. Kluver, an optometrist with Eye Surgeons Associates. Welcome to FYI. Today I'd like to talk to you about the visual acuity and visual field standards for driving. Getting or renewing your driver's license can be a stressful time for some, especially for the elderly, as they may be concerned that their vision may not be good enough to pass the test. With today's short video, I hope to give you a basic overview of the 2015 standards of what is expected visually to maintain a driver's license. I will focus on the states of Iowa and Illinois as we at eye surgeons have offices in both locations. In the state of Iowa, to get an unrestricted license, you must have 20-40 vision or better in at least one eye. If the vision in one eye is worse than 20-40, but at least 20-70, you can still get a license but will not be allowed to drive when headlights are required. If the vision in one eye is worse than 2070, but at least 2200, a license can be issued under a discretionary review process that may have to be approved by a medical board. Most importantly, that would also involve taking a behind the wheel driving test. If the vision in one eye is worse than 2200, no license can be issued. Bioptic telescopes, which are low vision accessory devices, are not allowed to achieve any of the standards that I just discussed. The visual field requirements for licensure in Iowa are as follows. Keep in mind that when we discuss binocular, we mean using both eyes. When we discuss monocular, we mean the field measurements out of just one eye. If the binocular field is equal to or greater than 140 degrees, no restrictions exist. If the binocular field is between 110 and 139 degrees, then the vehicle must have left and right outside mirrors. If the binocular field is less than 110 degrees or the monocular field is less than 100 degrees, but the person has greater or equal to 75 degrees in either the monocular field or the binocular field, then a behind the wheel driving test will be required. If the monocular or binocular field is less than 75 degrees, a behind the wheel test is required along with medical review board approval. The license will be denied if the monocular or binocular field is less than 20 degrees. In the state of Illinois, the acuity standards for both an unrestricted license and a daytime only license are the exact same as Iowa. Now, if the vision in one eye is worse than 2070, but at least 2100, then a bioptic telescope will be required in most cases, along with a driving test and board approval. In this situation though, night driving will not be allowed at any time. The license is denied when the vision is less than 2100 in one eye. The visual field requirements for Illinois are as follows. The unrestricted requirements are the exact same as Iowa. Now, if the binocular field is between 105 and 139 degrees, and one eye has at least 70 degrees temporally and 35 degrees nasally, then the vehicle must have left and right outside mirrors. The license will be denied if the monocular or binocular field is less than 105 degrees. Before we conclude, one last thing to note that is different between Iowa and Illinois is that in Illinois, it is your legal responsibility to notify the Secretary of State's office within 10 days of becoming aware that your acuity or field limitations may disqualify you from further driving. Thanks for watching. For more information on eye conditions, refer to our FYI videos on Eye Surgeon's YouTube channel.